Hey everyone, welcome back to The Hidden Brick, where today we're doing part two of the build of the LEGO Friends Heart Lake Performance School. This is how far we made it in part one. If you missed it, check it out. There's a link down below. But right now, we're going to move all this to the side because we are moving on. We're not going to revisit the stuff we've already done. We're on to bag number five. So, move the school off to the side because we basically finished the first floor in part one. So we've got a couple floors on the top that we're going to build now. So that's everything from bag five. And then we're going to bring one of these loose plates over that was in the box, just came loose in the box. Start with a large panel that's going to get a sticker. The sticker is decorated with a, it looks like a mirror, a towel hanging up, and then a roll of toilet tissue. So, guess what we're building? It's probably the restroom. things that's sitting right in front of you. You don't even see it. So that is our toilet area. Now it looks like we're going to build a sink. Of these tall bricks. Okay, so we have this door. Goes there with a tile. And we have our little restroom sticker on here. Three tall windows. One. Two and three. Next we have three of the shorter windows. frame. Next we have this bar piece with a flag element clicked on it. Put a sticker. This looks like it's a recording software. short one. Both go there. Some 
corner plates will help hold everything together nice and tightly. these one by ones. detail kind of scatter throughout it So, <clears throat> bring over our school, this piece simply attaches right there. Alright, so we're now on to bag number six. Okay, so just like bag number five, bag number six is using one of these loose plates and we're going to build another level of the school or another portion of it. It's basically the piece right next to the one that we just built. Have our windows again. that has a sticker in it. This looks like a music class. So we've got some music notes written on the whiteboard. That goes there. Gonna begin our corner plates. And this one gets a cross shaped plate. Have a lot of one by one plates, just like before. Kind of 
putting these tiles on a different order than we did on the other one. Not quite sure why, but we'll just go with it. Wonder if they're doing that just to avoid repetitiveness. It's a pretty easy build. Little structures like this are simple. You're just kind of stacking bricks. So we have some plates on the inside. These look like the desks in the classroom. Chairs. And we have a book, we'll fold closed. And this will get sticker number three. Looks like a music book. It's just shown sitting on top of a desk. Okay, so carefully bring over our school piece, attach that to the top, that fits perfectly there. So that completes bag six, so we're on to bag number seven. Okay, we have all of our bag seven parts out, bring on over another one of these plates, and we'll begin in this corner. the corner brick. Two windows. These both go here. Now we're going to have some of these arched pieces or curved slopes to kind of create a architectural stylized look to the front. piece there. Some inverted slopes. Okay, that kind of completes off that one side. Do some plates. Turn this around. Got some detailing on the back side of this. Looks 
like we have a speaker there. Is this another little performance stage? Uh, this may be the drum set. So this was one of the accessory pieces that I saw that we didn't build in the first bag of the set when we built all of the other accessory pieces. So we have this piece that goes here. Yeah, so this is the kick drum right there. Have some symbols. Sloped bricks. And our drumsticks. Just go back here with the drum set. All right. Bring the school over again. This piece it goes right on the top. That looks good. All right, <clears throat> we're on to our eighth and final bag. All right, we have everything for bag eight dumped out and it's basically gonna be a mirrored copy of the one we just built as far as the front stuff looks. The uh, I guess accessories on the inside will be slightly different. This is the last of our windows. I had a lot of these window pieces in this set. I said earlier I'm a fan of for all the building style mocks that I do it's a great part pack slopes here. Oops. Turn this around. We're gonna start putting some interior details already. Couple one by one plates. Ends of that. there 
All right. All right, last sticker time. You know you're almost done with the set when you get to your last sticker. And this is a kind of shiny reflective sticker. Kind of makes a mirror. See the camera. Okay. Put that one there. Yes, this is another little performance stage. Oh, this is the ballerina area. So there's our bar. Okay, next is a... Looks like a music musical instrument, maybe. Couple tiles, a couple slotted tiles, a couple plates. That one slipped out of my hand. Now we have our musical note area. So this is the little piano piece. It goes right there. <clears throat> There's a stool that whoever's playing the piano can sit at. Turn this around, do our slopes. Then we have our tiles, our little flower pieces. Completes this portion. Bring it over. You can see it pops right on to the, the other one. Kind of making a mess there with everything. So let me move this down a bit so we can see everything. This little musical organ pieces. To stay on so there's the inside of our school we have a cafeteria we have our lockers there's a bench there's the restroom it's like a recording studio you have the the band area they can play on the top and then you have a ballet studio up here with the musical instrument we'll turn this kind of like that don't forget about our Fancy little school bus and all of our accessory pieces. So we have a basketball hoop, minifigure, we have a bench with a loudspeaker. Here's our basketball. We have lunch table, a little performance stage. That's our school bus driver right there. Andrea, who can be performing on the stage, and then a camera as well to capture that performance. So there you go. That is the Lego Friends Heart Lake Performance School. So not a bad build. Um, the the structure is pretty basic. Kind of once you get past all of the um, 
accessory builds. Some of these are maybe a little bit difficult, but the actual school itself is pretty easy. The school bus is a nice touch, and then of course you have plenty of playability with it. So that's a pretty cool little set. So tell me your thoughts, put a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Check out a link down below to all of my other LEGO Friends builds. It's basically a playlist that you can binge watch all of my LEGO Friends videos. So don't forget to check that out and we'll see you in the next one.